FM 96.2. I'm clearly obsessed with the Toronto Blue Jays, and if I ever want to play like a Blue Jay, I'm going to have to start training. We're starting from the ground up. We're at Labatt Park. Come on. So here's a tip. I'm going to give you guys a tip. Whatever you do, do not show up to the field wearing flip-flops, all right? <laughs> so let's see how you do with the easy little catch here. All right. I got it! <laughs> now watch my throw, though. It's horrible. See, you're already laughing. For starters, I say just swing on back, straight over time. Alright. You're still laughing at me! Worst coach ever! <laughs> so, so I say you have five eyes when you throw, right? You want to point your five eyes at your target, okay? First eye being right above the knee. Okay. Right above the knee. Okay. Alright. The elbow, the shoulder, right? And your chin, right? All right. All five eyes facing your target. Alright. And a little blunt. <laughs> uh, maybe a little dance move. That's a little like a dance move here. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Alright. Now I got this. Right. So as you're pulling the ball out of the glove, right, the first thing you want to do is just get this arm into the back as far as you can and the comfortable, right? You have to just make up full. Alright? Alright. So and then you just want to work your way over top. Alright? Get the arm up top here. Alright? And as you're pulling forward toward your target, you want to create that skin on the baseball, right? So you're just going to allow your index and your middle finger to slightly roll off the baseball, creating a back spin for your target. Uh, okay, so five eyes facing my target. As comfortable as I can, and then. Now, as a point catch there, you're going to watch me and I'm going to point my five eyes as well, okay? I see all five. Right, they're right at you. Right at the target. Okay. I'm going to get my arm back, right? In a nice position. I'm going to step forward, get the arm up top, and allow the ball. Alright, so that's throwing. What about, what about catching? I say catching, you got the glove out front really well, right? So you just want to allow the ball to make contact with the web of your glove, right? Without stabbing at the ball, without coming forward, right? Let it come. Right, yeah. yeah. Let the ball fall in. Okay, and then when you, once you feel contact, you know, solid contact, then you close the web. Okay. Right? Another thing you could do is use two hands, right? Go back to fundamentals. Okay? So, as that ball is making contact with the web of your glove, just get this top hand, right? Over top. And we create what we call the alligator. Right. The alligator. Yeah, the alligator, right? And so we just close the mouth of the alligator. So now, on the catch, as far as the catching goes, everything's good for you. You have the glove out front, your eyes are on it, correct? Right? So we're just gonna keep the glove still this time. Okay? Your alligator looks real fast. Left. <laughs> left movement, left movement okay. in, in our glove, right? As we're wanting to catch the ball. Okay. All right? So we're just gonna keep it, keep our glove still. Sarah, let's talk hitting a little bit. Um, the first thing we want to do, right, is uh, find a bat that we're comfortable with, right? Length and weight. Second thing is batting gloves. Third thing is uh, is rhythm and, and a position at home plate um, that, you, that you're comfortable with. If you find yourself in the batter's box and you have your rhythm going, right, you want to create a nice wide base, right? nice wide stance, right? So I say slightly outside of the shoulder. Right? Okay. A lot like yourself right now. This right? is good? This is good. This is good. You could, you could maybe go a little wider, right? But for you, if you're comfortable there, then I say okay. I'm comfortable here. If you're comfortable good. there, I say okay. Alright, and then I say athletic position meaning maybe a slight bend in your knees, right? Okay. If you're comfortable with the slight bend, yep. right? But as we bend our knees, right, the butt starts to come up. Right? Why does it do that? Uh, it does. Hey, not only for the ladies, but for the men as well. <laughs> it just comes right up. <laughs> right? Yeah. <laughs> so we have to think about getting that butt low, right? Okay. Get that butt so basically, good. you're telling me I signed up for squats. Okay. Upper half. All right, for the upper half, I like to say, I like to tell my students to point their five eyes as well. Again, okay. Right? So now that you have your five eyes pointed, your nice wide base, find a position for your hands that you're comfortable with, right? With a loose grip. All right, you don't want to grip too tight. You don't want to jump in the batter's box and just start squeezing that bat. Naturally, at the point of contact, 
as that pitcher is throwing that ball and we're about to make nice hard contact. And with the sweet spot, which is right yeah. there. Your body is naturally going to tense up and you're going to get tight at contact. Yeah. Okay, so we start off with a loose grip. Right? Hands are loose, hands are up. I like to go somewhere around the ear area, right? In between maybe the ear and the shoulder. For where you're holding your hands? where I'm holding my hands. Okay. Right? right? And, I, and, and the next thing I want to do is I want to be careful not to have my hands extended here, right? I want them somewhere back into my body, right? Because this is a power position. So, question. Um, so, when a pitch is coming my way, what spot, like, in the air, over the plate, should my idea fall in? See, look for something about uh, letter high in the chest, right? So, like, here? Yeah, you know, right right around the Toronto, around the Blue Jay area. Uh, around the Blue Jay area. Right around the Blue Jay area. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. All right. Okay, so I'm looking for a pitch that's going to be about right. here. Uh, you're, looking, you're looking for a pitch that's about the, the Blue Jay area, about chest high, right? And I say um, just above the knee. So in this area, right. in this 60, area. 40 with 60, the weight. 60, 40, maybe bring this knee slightly forward a little bit, hit the floor a little bit, right? All right. Right there. That's a great position. Do you have your rhythm going? Your rhythm? Stay So next time we come out, mm -hmm. we're crushing balls mm -hmm. and we're running the bases. Okay. <laughs> You've been watching FM 96.2, streaming live at FM 96.com, London's best rock, FM 96.